What's up, guys? How's everybody doing today? Oh, I got that glass in my way. Oh. We're doing our shit today. We're doing our stuff. I gotta do like a college project, and I thought this would be the um the perfect opportunity to do like a stream where I'm actually like doing like a piece that I need to actually put everything into. So I'm actually super excited about this. Right. Uh, okay, cool. Oh yeah. Oh, but yeah, basically what we're doing is we're just going to set up. We're going to try to do some line work and do some basic color color in today. I'll probably lay I'll probably lay flats if I can. This uh, my flats aren't due this week, but I'd like to get ahead of it. I think I just have a couple quizzes to do this week. <gasps> hey, uh, hey, on and where? How you guys doing? And thank you very much, man. I thought that was a I thought it was really cool. And I think what I'm going to do with it is, is um, I'm going to do obviously like the very space based like background. I might do some. uh, I might do some. um, Like some purples and blues. Get that nice cool contrast with like Sonica Shadows golden colors. I think that'd be pretty cool. The problem is, is like I said before, I'm still getting um still getting used to how Photoshop feels compared to everything else. You know, I think I'm gonna throw one more layer. And then I'm going to do a fill. There we go. That works. And then we'll go player one. Works. How are you guys doing tonight? Also, can you can you guys see the canvas pretty well? Like is this stuff looking pretty good for you guys? I should actually probably um should actually probably tweet out that or uh post a story that I'm on. Also, um, if you guys follow SSJ underscore Sophia, it looks fine. Cool. Thank you. If you guys follow uh, SSJ Sophia on Instagram. She's live right now and she's a really good fucking artist. Really good freaking artist. Definitely go give her a follow. What am I doing? I got to add to my story. I'm going to post a picture. Okay. What's up, Swaggy? How you doing? Week three, here we go. <gasps> oh, I missed you guys. How you guys doing? A little lighter. Oh, what happened? Uh oh. I unplugged something. 
I like it. I don't know. Crap. Give me just two seconds. Nice. Just finished up homework. <laughs> I I adjusted I adjusted my thing. <sighs> Heck. Let's see. Give me two seconds. Oh wait. Okay, we're sweet. Just bring this back over here. I screwed. <laughs> I moved. I moved it, and for some reason, that lost its connection, which scared me because it's a nine hundred dollar drawing display, and I'm not about to be <laughs> not about to be happy with it. Uh, with it breaking on me. Finishing up homework. What kind of homework are you doing tonight? Okay. All right. I say. I say we get the important bits done first. AP language? Is it uh like English? I'm assuming. No, we'll do Yeah. I don't know. I'm I'm thirty years old, man. All right, so we're going to we'll probably start out with inks first. Oh, that's right. Okay. Which, all right. I didn't like that. There we go. Hey, Lil. How are you today? I should probably bring up references. Um, I'm doing great, man. It's uh, it's been a long week. been a long week uh i went to school monday i got lucky because my um my professor called in sick on mon or this last monday so i didn't have to um i didn't have to go to class early on uh on monday I didn't have to go to the class till like 2.30. It was really nice. All right.
Oh, that was a bit far. Oh. Hey, Zach, how you doing, man? How you doing, daddy? I figure we knock out the death egg first, that way... That way I got all, like, the really fine detail out of the way. Because I really want this to, like... To, like, look good. I want to impress my freaking... My professor. Because, honestly, I'm kind of starting to wonder if my professor actually likes me. And... I say that because... I say that because... I did, um, you guys saw that still life I did, right? On Twitter. Well, the still life I did on Twitter, I was really proud of because I'm not normally, I'm not normally used to drawing from like life. And his feedback to me was a very nice job. No critique, no nothing. Very nice job. It was like he was talking to a five year old with a crayon. <laughs> and it, it actually kind of upset me. Also, if you guys know if you, if you guys don't already know Chilla, go give her a follow too. Chilla's such a cool person. I think everybody in here knows Chilla though. But if you don't follow her, get your ass over there and follow her. Okay. Oh, dude, she's awesome. Such a great person. What's this? What is this Discord? Discord message? New one reds artwork. Ooh, where's working on Blaze? Where? Blaze is looking sick, man. Also, guys, I'm sorry I'm I'm not like I'm not like more on Discord. Like with school and everything been going on, it's been it's been wild. I wanna be on Discord more. That's also another thing I'd like to like I wanna I wanna I want to start doing YouTube content. And I think a big part of it is, is I'm kind of afraid to. Uh, bunch of cards. Bunch of cards there. I used to be on Discord a lot, a lot, when I was on Twitch, but my server kind of died. But when I started sharing it with you guys, it kind of got some life back into it. So I kind of want to try to like Make sure it like kind of makes a comeback. All right.
Damn it. Alright. See if I can't get a... No, I don't like that either. Quick little zoom out. No. No. Ah, that's going to be hard. You're in a lot of servers, but you're active in two. My mom's messaging. Yeah. I want to, I want to like get, I want to get better with it. be honest I want to be more active on YouTube that's the one place I want to be more active on I have a bunch of video ideas because I asked you guys a bunch of questions to see kind of like what you guys wanted to watch so I have a bunch of video ideas it's just I want to make sure they're good yeah long lines suck I feel like it's all right. Yeah, I kind of want this to have that that comic book feel. So I guess we'll see how this turns out. Actually, what I should probably do. File. I, I know there's a reference. There's a reference thing. There we go. Oh. There. Now. Now I know what I'm looking at. I'm kind of going roughly off of it, but. I want I'm not sure if I should build these in to be honest I think I'm going to anyway But no, I just, I don't know. What kind of stuff would you guys like to see on YouTube? I'll ask you guys again. I know you guys wanted some tutorials. Would you like to see me do with stuff on YouTube other than art? I got a little bit of lag going on.
eventually to once I'm getting better at like the landscape stuff and whatnot I might I'm gonna kind of try to start get away from Sonic a little bit I mean I'm always I'm always gonna love love to draw Sonic and honestly like if there's a job I could ever nail down it's definitely gonna be an artist for like IDW but I do want to get better at stuff that way I can you know be a bit more versatile We're gonna take, oh, take this pencil in here. Gonna, yeah. Yeah. There we go. Make it a little more dynamic. I don't like that. That's uh that's a big thing I want to do too is work on um work on human structure uh like anatomy um anatomy I want to work get better at environments cuz your biggest thing is is the biggest problem is is, is yeah you can be a good you can be a good Sonic artist, but you're never going to get an official position if all you know how to draw is Sonic and really nothing else. And I want to, I want to, I want to just get better. Lighting is another thing I'd like to work on too. I'll get that. Probably stand to lower my brush size a little bit. You know what I just realized? I didn't even, I marked the end of that crap. guys look pretty good are we going a little It's 
better. <laughs> Thanks, Ricky. No, I just want to make sure it looks good for class. It's one of those, one of the few, few times I'm not just doing this for fun. Which is kind of why I wanted to, I wanted to do this in class too. It's like, I wanted to, I wanted to actually see if like, like I could push myself and make like a really decent drawing. That's not what I wanted. Zoom in. And typically when I ink my drawings, I do stop at the, I do start at the top left. It's just like a habit from like when you do traditional art and you're doing, you're doing that. You start from like the top, like where you're most comfortable and then you work your way down that way you don't smudge your lines. Of course you can't smudge your lines in Photoshop, but. Okay, now we can work on, uh, on our edge boy. We can work on the edge hog now. Okay. I didn't. You start with the nose. I always usually draw like the circle shape. I draw the crosshairs and then I start with the muzzle. Yeah, I do the muzzle first. Honestly, sometimes I've actually drawn. Um, I've actually drawn the eyes a couple times before. I drew his nose a bit small. I usually start with like the or the nose, but like sometimes I do like the eyes first. Yeah, there we go. That's a bit better. And that way I don't have a tangent where his like where his muzzle is. You do the circle shape, then start with the eyes. I see a lot of people do that. I try not to be so sketchy with my lines, but sometimes I can't help it. And sometimes it's kind of an artistic style that I go for. Like if you guys saw my one shadow piece I did a while back, um, I did like a really sketchy like design to kind of like simulate the flow of movement. And I liked how that turned out. All right, later where you have a great night. Now here's a good question. When you guys draw a shadow, you guys do draw like the sections where it's red? Do you line them? Or do you leave them blank and then color them in red? Cause I'm kind of wondering if I should do that. That's kind of what I do. I usually line them. You line them too? Yeah, that's kind of what I was thinking. I couldn't decide what I wanted to do because like I said, I want to make sure this looks good.
Oopsie. No, I don't like that. Um, that looks better. I won't lie to you guys. I think I, I think I still prefer um, drawing on my uh, drawing on my Samsung. I wish there was a better program for it though. Like honestly, if I could get like the level of the level of. Uh, Custom customization that I can get on Photoshop or any other drawing drawing software. Yeah, I do. A, I I primarily draw on mobile. Oh, did you see that line? Did you see that line? That line was good. I'm very happy with that line. Least favorite part about drawing on mobile though is constantly accidentally undoing accidentally undoing a uh a line with my palm Um, I heard I heard a lot of good things about Medibang. Um, I use Infinite Painter, and I'm very fond of Infinite Painter. But as since you're a mobile artist, you probably know this. But once you get so many layers in, stuff starts to goof up. And it's not fun after a while. Ow. Oh, that line too. Okay, we're getting better at this. Oh, let's get it. let's get in there. A little a little eh.
use Ibis. I heard some good things about Ibis. Infinite Painter is probably the closest thing you can get to procreate on Android. That's why I use it, because I prefer Android products over um, Apple. And that's about the best I can get. Although, if I do ever get around to it, I will probably buy an iPad with an Apple Pencil just so I can um, have Procreate. And I'll probably start using start using Procreate a bit more. bumpy there we I also wouldn't mind being able to use Clip Studio Paint a bit more. But since I'm in school, I'm opting for Photoshop. I have to use Photoshop. How's that? Paint looks, looks good. Oh. Forgive me, but what's dark lead? Something I don't know about? an AU. I've got to work. I've got to work on a uh, I'm in the process of trying to get an OC out. Because I notice a lot of Sonic artists like a lot of Sonic artists have their own OC and everybody seems to have fun with those. 
and I also want to create a, a few original characters for the Sonic fan comic that I want to do. I got a lot of things that I want to do, but I just got to. I want to find, see, the reason why I haven't drawn an OC yet is because, um, I want one, I want to make one that actually fits in with, like, Sonic's universe. <clears throat> and I feel like some OCs, they're just a little too out there. Like, like I see Tangle and Whisper, and I'm like instantly like, yeah, those are Sonic characters. <clears throat> yeah. And so like, like I said, I see Sonic and or I see T or I see Tangle and Whisper, and I'm like, yeah, those are definitely Sonic characters. And I want one that like fits in that dynamic. And I feel like my character design skills just aren't right there yet. It might just be I'm just afraid to do it too. I've been seeing a lot of uh a lot of honey the cat lately too. A lot of people seem to want her back. And that was like an official Sonic character that like had a very unique take on her. She almost feels I'm getting super sketchy towards here at the bottom. I don't like that. Um she almost feels fan art. Like she feels very um uh not official in spite of being official.
All right, how's it look, guys? <clears throat> Do I usually draw while listening to music? Um, it just depends on the situation. Like, <clears throat> sometimes I do. Um, mainly for stream, I I like to I like to draw with music. That way, it's not like dead silent. Give my hand a little second to rest. Let's see, how's he? How's he looking about that sketch layer? Looks pretty good. Oh, I didn't. I missed the line. Um, yeah, sometimes I do too. Um, there was a there was a piece that I did that I was super proud of. Uh, it was the Sonic and the Black Knight pick that I did. And I must have listened to Night of the Wind like a hundred fucking times. There we go. That's better. That's a better. And then sometimes what I like to do is like I'll go in and I'll just like Add a little dude night of the wind slaps hard holy crap i love that song so much But no, like sometimes I'll sometimes I'll listen to uh, listen to some music. Oh, um, <clears throat> hold on, I got a guy for you. Game Apologist has a really cool looking uh, face mask right now. I'm retweeting that. Or Sammy. Hello, Sammy. Go look at that guy's artwork. <clears throat> Make sure you let him know uh, Mask has sent you. But yeah, he he does some really cool. Um, he he did the really cool Excal Excalibur Sonic piece.
should probably minimize this piece right now. <sighs> get our get our blue boy over here. Or well yellow boy. Yeah, uh Sam hasn't been really doing a whole lot of a uh of Sonic artwork. Um, as of late, but now, or if you go through like his stuff, it's it's looking pretty good. Give that hand a little bit of a, a little bit of a rest. I'm actually talking to Chilla right now. <laughs> Chilla, but in here. Be like, Chilla, we're watching a mediocre Sonic artist do, uh, draw Sonic for school. <laughs> You're just trying to close with her. We chat once in a while. Um... Chill is one of those, one of those artists I found it really easy to talk to. Her art style is crazy. You know what? I think I'm gonna throw on my drawing glove because my hand's getting sweaty. My hand is getting sweaty. And I don't want to, don't want to get sticky. I also just remembered I have a drink. Yeah, you can't be afraid to talk to him. Um, 
I I had that kind of intimidation too. And what's funny is this for me, my intimidation comes from the idea that I am a reasonable age older than most of the Sonic artists on Twitter. There's maybe a fraction of us that are above 25. And so it's like, I don't want to come across as like some weird guy or whatever. I don't like that line. But I also want to make friends in this community because I absolutely love this hedgehog. And I also want to make this into a career. Yeah. If I would have jumped down on this a little bit earlier, it wouldn't be so weird for me, but. I'll zoom in on there. But believe you me, I've been playing these games since I was old enough to hold a controller. The first Sonic the Hedgehog came out the summer after I was born. Oh, too shaky. Too more, too hard. Too stupid. Too stupid. Eh. No. Ah. <sighs> That's a rough game to start out on. I tried playing it once. When it first came out for Wii. God, I hate, I hate petting lines. Line petting sucks. Um, I tried playing that game once and it did not go well. I don't think I got past the first level. My first actual Sonic game that I remember was Sonic 2. Um, then I went back and played Sonic 1 because I was old enough to remember. I'm not gonna lie though, the cutscene at the very end with uh with the Razor Jin is one of the most badass cutscenes in Sonic Hedgehog. Told you I'm not a rat. I'm a hedgehog. As much as I like, <clears throat> as much as I like the aesthetic aesthetic of Sonic and the Black Knight, I've never played it. <clears throat> I miss him too. See, I have a problem with the Sonic community when it comes to how they treat each other, when it comes to like what they think about the games. Because me, I'm I'm just a pure Sonic fan. Like, yeah, <coughs> man, it's really back there. Like, it yeah, it looks like it's much more manageable than Secret Secret Rings. I couldn't get past the first level because it was just it was so weird. 
but no the problem with like they, they rip each other apart over what's good and what's not and for me i like i said i'm i'm just a general sonic fan like yeah i i'll i'll admit that there's bad games but i like i like sonic i just like what sonic like the personification of sonic and like that's why i um that's why i like jason griffith's sonic the hedgehog because i feel like that is like the best modern interpretation of sonic the hedgehog that didn't make him seem like a 90s like a 90s pop culture icon like he emulated all the attitude of what sonic was supposed to be but he they made a more modern take of it i was not a fan of the meta era like it was too much dry humor for me Yeah, Jason was definitely my definitely my favorite modern Sonic. Um If you ask me straight up what my favorite Sonic voice actor is, I'm going to tell you Julia White. Julia White is the best personification of classic Sonic. That's way too sketchy. Get the sketchy. But I just liked how Jason sounded. Ryan Drummond was a close second. I was super bummed to hear that uh that Emmy actually wasn't gonna be Tails. As much as I like Colleen, I definitely think we need more um Need more fans at the helm of this uh, series. I don't think it's as bad as what people think it's going to be. Tell me one piece of Sonic media that wasn't a game that ended up being bad. The movie was great. All the animated shorts are great. Sonic Boom was good. Not the game, the show. A lot of people seem to be worried about it, and they like the they're like immediately talking crap about it already. And it's like, what are you talking about? Like We haven't had a bad piece of Sonic media outside of a video game yet. Like, people still, like, regard Sonic X as one of the best animated Sonics ever, but how many complaints do you see about it? And that's why I say fans. That's why I say fans should be like taking the helm. Oh, it's not right. Oh.
What do you guys think so far? Ah, it's a fully inked piece. Yeah. Um. Rogers era wasn't well received because as much as I like Roger and his work ethic and he is a very good voice actor, I don't think he fit Sonic. His voice is too, um, he made Sonic seem like really like a lot older than what he was he had a really deep voice and after hearing jason sonic that was very jarring i remember playing sonic colors and i remember playing sonic colors and that's that's kind of how i felt about it amazing game i don't care what anybody says about that game He was perfect for Boom Sonic. Boom Sonic is where I really felt like um like Roger was doing really well. Almost didn't draw draw in his uh stuff. There we go. Better. Yeah, he played a really good Boom Sonic. I did like that. But seeing seeing like almost feel like with every new voice actor comes oh yeah thanks Swaggy. i didn't see that sorry um i feel like with every new era of sonic needs to be like a like a redesign and i feel like roger fell into the boom redesign as badly as boom blew up um like wasn't good the cartoon was really really good it was really funny and it fit like it made it so the meta era like fit really good. Hey, what's up universe? Like that's that's my that's just my opinion on it. I feel like I feel like he fit in better with the boom universe for sure. Just going over and seeing if there's anything that I want to change. streaming for i've been it took me an hour to do shit i definitely feel like i put more work into shadow than i put in on sonic thank you what probably what we'll do is we'll probably do like a black like a like a like maybe like a like a light blue gradient to a black um like a black background and then we'll put like maybe a little color some stars in there and then <clears throat> we'll probably use the the <clears throat> death egg reference that i have and then color the death egg like that and then we'll do sonic and shadows colors by eye just because i feel like 
like as much as I like going by the official color scheme as much as I can um I feel like it it makes your work a little look a little bit more original if you use your own color scheme like get it as close as possible for sure but it just makes you look makes it look like it's your own so start another layer under our sketch layer and then oh dude I'm a hardcore Zelda fan Legend of Zelda Metroid um hey Wolf how you doing man I've been good what have you been up to um Zelda Metroid um uh, great put me on the spot Kingdom Hearts um what else oh uh I'm not the biggest fan of Mario but I do like Mario enough um I actually started playing Robert Ross's levels that um the game grumps are doing right now You've been playing WoW and MC? Have you been on the server? Oh, and thank you. Thank you, sir. I've been playing Rubber Ross's levels on Mario Maker, on Mario Maker 2. So like the most recent Game Grubs episodes, those levels are the ones I'm playing. Ross the Sadist. Um... And I've been uh, playing the crap out of Breath of the Wild lately. Just because Breath of the Wild brings me like peace. I like I like the quiet atmosphere. Yeah, those levels are not for the faint of heart, Swaggy. But let's see. I, I, I like... Oh God, I'm like a big fan of Metroid. Is your stuff still there? I haven't I haven't seen anybody on that server. I'll hop in once in a while. I'm kind of waiting for that update to come out. Once the update comes out, I'll probably jump back on Minecraft. Didn't you say I blew up with crystals or is that the am I thinking the wrong person? What's up, Shra? Yeah, crystals. Yeah. No, I haven't seen anybody. I haven't seen anybody on there in quite a bit. Okay. So the plan is, how are you doing, Shra? You having a good day? 
the plan is is we're gonna make that my professor's not gonna know what to do with me because this is intro to freaking intro to digital art what we're gonna do is yeah you're right it's not i need to get back on minecraft like i said i'm waiting for i'm waiting for uh the update to come out then i probably will so what we'll probably do is is we're gonna make the death egg shine like the moon kind of like uh like the reflective surface Just came came out of work. Not bad. Uh, this is actually a uh, school project that I'm working on. Take our pencil tool. I <laughs> yeah, it was the arc. Uh, I did the I did the death egg just because it was just a sphere, and I feel like it would have it would have worked out. Let's see. We'll just go with your basic yellow on this one, and then we'll hide his layer. And then we'll just start blocking color or Sonic. Just to test it out, I want to do that fill. Fuck okay. it. Got it. Sweet. Get my pencil tool again. This is the way my teacher wants me to do it. But I almost feel like I kind of want to like. I kind of feel like I want to do like a clipping mask. Actually, I don't even need to ink that part in. Blocking color there. Uh... <laughs> it 
What's up, Dr. Eggman? Evening, rural chum. I love that line. Thinking, thinking my uh, girlfriend is coming in here. Good to hear. Um, I've been hearing a lot about Max Metalman. I think he'd be a great, uh, a great modern Sonic. What else? Um, other than that, I'm really not, I'm really kind of like, I'm cautiously optimistic. I think that I think that Prime is going to be good. But as far as the voice cast goes, I am not sure. Zoom out, paint bucket, bam, bam, dandy. No, 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 shot. You're absolutely right. But since this is a school project, I'm just kind of going around, going about it. And uh, the way that they want it. Go a little more yellow with it. Okay. So that's why they want, that's why they got me with the pencil tool doing it. I don't know why, because I completely agree with you. I usually use, um, I usually use a color layer and then I use a clipping mask and then I fill in the layer and then work in the colors after that. But. Did they really? Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna start working stuff out. Um, just to make it clear, line art. And then Sonic yellow. And then we're going to add another layer. Shadow yellow. It is a school project uh, for college. So I, like I said, I chose, I chose doing this cause I really want to make it really work. Yeah, but no, I, I definitely agree that if I were to do this on my own volition, I would have literally just blocked it, blocked in. Um, blocked in color and then used a clipping mask.
What about you guys? What are you guys hoping for? Um, for a voice cast for the new uh, new Sonic show or the, even the movie. I've heard so many rumors about who's going to be Knuckles that it's not even funny. <laughs> you think Colleen's going to reprise her role as Tails? I'd be kind of bummed if she didn't. Just see if I got that right. Boop. Got it. Boop. Yeah, I think he's a good fit. Oh, dude, I miss Shadow from SA2. I definitely agree that Shadow Shadow's personification is definitely a bit lackluster nowadays. I definitely don't like Shadow as much as what I used to. I love his design, but other than that, like... Um... Outside of his voice acting in the Sonic, uh, Sonic 2020 fan game was pretty good for him. Fill in everything. <laughs> Boom. How they look, guys? Add that layer back. I like it. Leopold the Braver? back off i might change that gradient i don't like that color blue ow my knee Ugh. leopold the brave oh okay so now We're gonna do death egg. Death egg, we will bring up the death egg.
The death egg seems to be roughly the same color. So we're going to do I'm going to do that greenish color. Okay on that. Crap. I race. I I disagree. Mark Hamill is a great actor. Great Joker. But he makes he makes if he was to do Eggman, he would make Eggman sound way too like high pitched and cackly, I th I feel. And Eggman's really gruff. There we go. Now let's add. <laughs> I mean, oh, probably. Let's see, where do I want to go next? Probably do Shadows Reds. So. It's. Believe me, it's uh, it's like a college thing. Uh, all right. Uh, oh, shadow. And then. Okay. Shadow yellow. Then we're going to add a folder. Sonic. Sonic in that folder. What is happening here? <laughs> but yeah, no, um. Basically, the assignment was a digital art assignment. <clears throat> and it was like, oh, just, you know, draw whatever and. Okay. 
There we go. Cool. Basically, it was a digital art assignment, and they were pretty much like, do whatever. And I was like, okay, I'm drawing Sonic. Like, that's the plan. Let's go in a little more. There we go. Just to make sure I'm getting all that color. By the way, guys, this is also my first full piece on this tablet. Or on this drawing display. And if it's good enough, I'll probably sell prints of it. If you guys are interested. I've got three, I got two pieces right now that I want to put, put up for sale for prints. I just haven't gotten around to it yet. One, I need the money to either buy the prints from a site or two I need to have the money to um uh you know what I'm gonna do his eyes in one go to um have the money to get like a printer so I can do my own homemade prints Mario copied Sonic, Sonic copied QZ. I mean, yeah. You gotta think, Dragon Ball Z was like the popular show at the time. When Sonic first like had his idea. Or when they first came up with Super Sonic. I can definitely see where the inspiration comes from. But a lot of franchises do that. They'll take inspiration from anywhere. His, the tongues of his shoes and his, um, the tongues of his shoes and the base of his, his actual shoes themselves, they aren't the same red, are they? They're like a little bit darker, I'm assuming, right? Am I just crazy? seen the amount of just stuff that just comes out 
for Sonic. I think all I really have left to do for Sonic is his nose, his muzzle, and his, like, his muzzle colors and his whites. Oh, okay. Okay, we're gonna do... We're gonna do Sonic's nose real quick. Sonic nose. All of this stuff, like if you if you guys are working in Photoshop, making layer, making layer stuff is really useful. Like labeling all your layers is useful because if you're working in a professional setting, it's gonna be really helpful for you. Keep your stuff organized. We're going to do Shadow's Nose. People are also changing their mind about Snow 06. 06 was terrible. I don't care what you say. It was terrible. The story. Uh, the story was. Could have had some things changed. I honestly, 06 Shadow was my favorite Shadow though. Yeah, uh, wasn't wasn't there an interview that said like straight up like they forgot. <laughs> They're like, oh, yeah, that's right. She's from another dimension, not another time. Let's see, that's cool. Oh, crap. I feel like it's a little darker than that. That feels more right. Okay. Still, though. Not okay. <laughs> it was weird. You know what's funny about that though? Is I hear so many complaints about about Elise kissing Sonic and how weird it was. But it all comes from the same fandom that draws Sonic and Shadow doing dirty shit with each other. Just saying. 
Oh yeah, that looks good. That looks real good. Just saying. All comes from the same community. Me and Wolf, uh, me and Wolf have talked about this before with, uh, with, um, what level furry are you? <laughs> I mean, it's true. Okay, bromances and stuff. Like, I understand. I understand that stuff. I just, I can't do. I can't do sexual stuff, man. I can't do it. They're cartoon characters. They're video game characters. I can't. And Wolf, you you could very well be right, but. <sighs> Just, yeah, that looks okay. I think I was a level three, a level three or a level two furry. Don't get me wrong, I like me my Nekos. But I can't do actual animals, man. That's weird. What level did you say you were, Wolf? See, I even have a hard time with ship art. Like, I'm not against it. I just, it's not, it's not what I see Sonic as. You'll see a lot of people say that, like, they feel uh, that um, Sonic the Hedgehog has a shonen soul. And I agree with that. Sonic was meant to be, like, high octane, action packed. And I kind of just go with that. Like, I'm not against it being what it has been. But I'd also rather see it the way it used to be portrayed as. <laughs> you just find the chart, link it to him. What level furry are you? <sighs> I'm not even on the list. <laughs> there we go. I think that's the only reason why they haven't done it. Um, I think they really are hinting at Sonic and Amy, though. Because they kind of want Sonic's, like, Sonic's Amy to be like Mickey's Minnie. Did I just hear Shadow? I'm a level six furry. They confirmed Son Amy, kind of. Oh shit. Um, okay. Shadow still needs blacks. Shoes and stuff. Oh yeah, and boom, and boom, yeah. No, that's definitely a thing. Yeah, that's most definitely a thing. Yep. 
you know what? I'm just going to do darker tones for shadow shoes. Let's see. Sonic, all he needs is his whites left. Shadow still needs his pole. Get up. Let me get rid of this death egg for you guys. Sorry. <clears throat> um, I think they're hitting at it in forces heavily. Or at least IDW is. Twitter takeover? Yeah, no, they're definitely uh, hinting at it in uh, IDW Sonic the Hedgehog. I think what they did with Sonic and Shadow is they know that the fandom want that one part of the fandom wants Sonic and Shadow to be a thing and so they're really like kind of just letting them have it but if you ever see Sonic and Amy interact in that comic it's definitely Sonic and Amy or a thing Yeah, with Shadow, I don't see Shadow and Ruse being uh, in, like, a thing, at least in IDW. They're more of, like, they look out for each other, but it's more of Rouge is the babysitter and Shadow just wants to <sighs> rain hell on everything. Oh yeah, but then again, I mean, really think about it. The Sonic Sonic fan base is always gonna be upset. Okay. Okay. Yeah, his reds on his gloves, his shoes are definitely darker than his definitely darker than his uh spines everyone has their own AU yeah Why my professor said to do it like this is on taking so long. I'd have had these guys in full color by now. I kind of want to get into more like more of like a painterly type style too. Like I kind of want to just do everything in a way where it's almost on the same layer. Oh, I 
first up. Try this now. Boop. Boop. Okay. Boop. All right, cool. I absolutely love Silver and Blaze being a thing. I really do like that. Like I said, I don't get super weird about it, but um I goofed. Shadow shoot reds. Okay, this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna move shadow blacks down here. Dude, I have one AU. I have one AU. And it fits in with like it fits in with like um IDW super hard. And that's um with there we go with um silver silver um silver's from a time where he grew up and everything was destroyed. And he never got to see, never got to see what the world was like when it was like had flora and fauna and a bunch of stuff that like, you know, that Sonic and his friends would have. So when he comes into Sonic's world and sees all the flora and fauna, he can't get over how beautiful it is and just admires like just admires nature and I feel like Silver has a very like a very kind personality where like he would just like just chill with like flickies and stuff and just really appreciate nature and I, I, I'm so in love with that idea Edgy AUs are the best. That's another... That's another reason why I kind of want to, like... I've been really waiting to, like, develop my, uh... My OC. It's because I want to make as good of a headcanon for my OC as what I do for Silver. And then 
issue yellow. And we're just gonna... Pencil in a yellow down here. Now we just need to work. Oh, I didn't go in. Oh, undo. I went in the wrong layer. There we go. Pencil. That. There. I unfortunately do not. Like I said, I'm working. I'm working on an OC, but I want to. I want to make sure I get it as good as possible. <laughs> there's an A. There. There's an EXE. There's EXE OCs. Never even heard of that. Okay. We want. Oh. Rings. Now we're going to. Uh, we're going to eye drop this yellow. Then we're gonna go in and kind of kinda orange it up. Just, yeah. just a hair. So should I post this? Should I post the flats to Twitter? Or should I wait till it's completely done? It might be a couple weeks though. I don't know what's going I don't know what's going on with class. I say if you're gonna do fan kids, do like um something that's not normal. <gasps> Vector and vanilla. <laughs> Good luck with that one. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> oh. Now that they got color in them, I'm not so big of a fan. I'll be straight up. I'm not a fan of it. Ugh, I hate that. I hate it when it comes out like that. Usually it goes by the mother. You can draw like a rabbit with like teeth.
like a just sharp teeth bunny. Okay, now I'm going to do. Shadow Whites. That with pencil. Zoom in, start doing all the shadows whites. Yeah, I think that'd be cool. No, I, I goof. I goof it. You know, let's turn on. Oop. Oh, you look at that. <laughs> that looks cool. My favorite moment with them, with the game drums. You want me to pick a moment? Oh God. I, by far, I, I'd say my top favorite moments, like hands down would probably be anything that has to do with the Mario Maker stuff. Here's a better idea. Opacity. There we go. Better. Yeah, um, Dan and Aaron are absolutely hilarious. So to ask me to pick what my favorite Game Grumps moment is, is like... Did you guys lose me? Did you guys lose me? My computer just said that OBS disconnected. That's why I was like, oh. <laughs> okay, good. All I need to know. Um, there was one, if you look. Oh, <laughs> I can, I can say one right now where they're talking about Sonic the Hedgehog and they're like, they're talking about Sonic and it's like, oh God, how's it go? What does he say? Dan comments on um how 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 it would look with uh sonic if he like well pooped while he was running he's like <laughs> no one will ever know <laughs> he's just running along and just <laughs> oh dude that one killed me that one was funny um oh god you guys don't even understand when I first started watching Aaron Hansen, he was Eagle Raptor. And I remember watching Girl Chan in Paradise, which was one of his like animated series on Newgrounds. It was like three episodes, funny as hell. Um The Awesome series was amazing. Oh yeah, dude, that one got me good. Uh, he he just had a moment on uh, his Mario Maker stream while he was playing playing and um oh god what did he what did he say um he said something he said something about like um Dan said something and. 
Aaron absolutely lost his mind. He was laughing so freaking hard. Ah, oh, man. I wish I knew it. I, I wish I could remember right off the top of my head. I just watched it yesterday, so of course I don't remember. But I literally was like 5 o'clock in the morning eating, eating, uh, um, eating, uh, Fritos honey barbecue twists. <laughs> and and I'm like damn near choking on choking on my food. It was so funny. There's so many good ones. But if there's one that sticks out to me, it's the one it's the one where they're talking about Sonic Poopy and it's just like can't catch me. <laughs> no one will ever know. I'll be gone before they get there. <laughs> oh dude. I think my favorite I think my favorite parts are when uh when Aaron laughs. Because if you get Aaron to laugh, especially like genuinely laugh, like he wasn't expecting to laugh that hard, it's freaking funny. Hey hey, head out, huh? Oh when they're um the up dog incident oh my god yeah i do remember that one um anytime they they are like role playing in a game like when they're playing zelda and they pretend they're the princess <laughs> like words have escaped me i'm without words ah! i'm without words like she just keeps talking that that yeah that's a funny part okay what did what did i I'm sure. oh yeah dude i want that that's how i found out about him is like all those animations are just top tier Can I? Can I do this right? Can I? There. Now let's try. Got it. Got it. Now Shadow is fully flatted out. Now let's do Sonic's flats. And I think that will be. Oh, dude, I love I love there's all the role playing. There's all the role playing episodes. Did do. Has that all been rotated the entire time? Oh, that's super annoying. <laughs> all right, um, Sonic yellow. No one ever know. Yeah, that one too. Um, when they were playing Sonic Boom, Rise of Lyric, <laughs> and Aaron's like, "Hold on, I gotta do something," and he starts glitching out. He starts glitching out knuckles with the pot with the pause jump, and freaking Dan's losing his mind. <laughs> oh, that one was too good. The knuckles glitch had me going, man. And then Aaron just getting angry because the game just sucked so bad. All of it hilarious. It was literally the first thing. It was literally the first thing Aaron did when they played the game. He's like, hold on, I gotta do something real quick. <laughs> and he starts doing the pause glitch. And Dan's like, Aaron, Aaron, what are you what are you doing? What Aaron? What are you doing? <laughs> oh the yoda jokes from the mario maker oh dude well they they actually talked about that in the last episode they're like this whole comp compilations where dan just says aaron's name in disappointment 
It's so freaking funny. They're so self-aware too. Like, does anybody remember the funny joke bit? The funny joke. And just Dan's just like, Aaron, stop. When I think of more, I'll say it. <laughs> mm! Funny joke! Oh, I goofed. Undo. Pencil. Go back up. Got it. Dandy. And the boys are flatted out. Now let's bring the background back up to 100% opacity. What do you guys think? Honestly, I think I've done better. <laughs> and that's just like, this is just flats right now. Oh, I lost a follower on Twitter. Dude, Koopa but Green's artwork is at like, how do you do it, man? How do you do it? How do you get such crisp lines? How do you get such crisp lines, Koopa? You, fin you finished the design for Vanilla X Vector. Vanilla X Vector fan kid, huh? All right, so this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna file, save as, Sonic and Shadow is a Photoshop document. Do I wanna replace it? Yes. Okay. All right, cool. Then we're gonna go file, save as, a JPEG, and then Uh, screw stuff. And then, so. okay. He's a grim boy. Ye. Now, what was I doing? Start. Two ten digital. Blocking and color with Adobe Photoshop. Eight February fourteenth five. Share your discussions on products here. Add a new discussion topic. All right.
Now who's next? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Forum. Progress. Sanes. I've seen a lot of Sanes. You know it. Discussion stuff's done. Drawing on. Okay. Let's see if I can. I, oh man. Okay, this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna. I'm going to see if I can find Let's see. Um Oops. I want to share something with you. Like the massive. Oh, hello. I didn't. Oh, this was so you uncomfortable. There. I'm here to talk to you about Skillshare, what the sponsor of today's video. Skillshare is an <laughs> online learning community with thousands it's of so, inspiring uh... classes for creative and curious people. The classes are so small. Okay, enough of that. Grump out, or at least on the Game Grumps reaction compilation is an instant karma compilation. Those oh, are those yeah. are my absolute favorites. Whoops. Yeah, they're Whoops. they're um very eye opening. <laughs> So every time I'm like, check <laughs> this out, here we go. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. see, it's gonna be tight. I'm trying to find it. There's, it's in this um, video. Candies like that stay on target. Um, oh, I played this level today and it literally hurts. Um, what the? F oh, I to mess with your fucking what the fuck? <laughs> fuck! No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh, wait. <laughs> we are ready to continue. <laughs> I, guess it, <laughs> I guess it wasn't as great an option. Can you guys hear it, all right? <laughs> do, 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 fuck. Oh, but it does retain your... Mm. Gotta beetle. watch out for the beetle. Uh, grab it, grab I can't it. grab it, I can't grab it, I can't... Uh. <laughs> do, 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 do. Uh. All right. God, I love Tommy Boy. Oh. Uh, you don't need to do any of that. Yeah, I do. We gotta yep. go. Go. I'm pretty sure it was on this level, too. Oh, uh -huh. uh, oh man. Here we go. Okay, and we're off. <laughs> 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 it's like, it's, I swear to God, man, like, The Simpsons is so filled with, like, such simple, beautiful comedy. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is funny, too. It's time. The fucking, the, f the bit that always kills me. <laughs> Please don't tell anyone how I live. <laughs> <That> <laughs> yeah. shit's so fucking funny. 
Why does it sometimes? Why does it sometimes? It knocks it, but other times it's I well, land right on it. When you've been hit by the chain chomp and you're all flashy flash, it doesn't. It lets you. It, How if such a thing could be possible? It's okay. It's okay. Whoops. Oh. Oh, oh, almost made it oh, work. Whoa. Oh, this dude. level made me so <laughs> mad earlier. I literally should be streaming these levels. He's all like, da -da -da -da. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking. <laughs> Please don't tell anyone how I live. <laughs> it's just so fucking eloquently funny. All right. Oh. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Done it. My favorite is, well, actually, there are many. But one of my favorites is, I must have told this a thousand times on Grumps, but where uh, Homer's talking to Bart and telling him this story. It's like, you know, he's trying to give him life advice. Yeah. And he's like, you know, Bart, when I was your age, I fell off my bicycle and hit my head on the ground. I watched Ro the Ross react to it, too. Brain damage. And Bart's like, Dad, what's the point of this story? <laughs> Homer's like, mm, I like I stories. like stories. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so uh, Love it. So, come on. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. I'll find it. Stupid. Going. You like it? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Here's the part. <laughs> he was like, please, please, <laughs> please stop. This fucking killed me. Yeah. <laughs> you like it? <laughs> okay. I gotta. I gotta. Yeah, the I gotta I put in the context too. Shit. I can't believe anybody watches this show. Do you remember when you were <laughs> telling me that story about how? You were at your house one day, f like folding laundry and just going, Yeah, yeah, <laughs> you like it? <laughs> and just said, Susie was like, Please, please, <laughs> please stop. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you like it? <laughs> yeah, I can't even do it. I can't get as high as you can. <laughs> it's like, yeah, yeah, you like it? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Fold the laundry. <laughs> Go. <laughs> oh man! That moment of ecstasy at the end. Go. <laughs> so funny. Fuck. <laughs> oh yeah, that's what it is. It's the, my pussy aches for more Pokemon. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't realize that voice had been in my life for so long. God, can you? Can you even count how many times oh, God. I shouted that in front of a live studio audience? It's <laughs> pretty special. In a, in, a, in a city that I'm not from. Yeah. Like, It's, it's a beautiful whoops. thing. Well, is there a way you can toss it upwards? Mm. Oh! oh. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> you like it? <laughs> no! Right. Dude, their voice, their, their voice impersonations are hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I'm so glad I was recording so I could listen back to it later at another time in my life. <laughs> this is the man I used to do comedy with. <laughs> he was my best friend. Yeah. We don't speak much anymore. <laughs> Sometimes I think he's still out there. Oh yeah. Sometimes I I wonder if he's still out there. Violating the restraining order. <laughs> <laughs> but also, you look wistfully out the window. No. Oh god. I told you. Was that it? My friend John, uh, once said it would be amazing. This one. Oh, I hate this one. <laughs> Scatman made those sounds I hate rock while he bottom. was falling downstairs. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, this is it. This is it. Be amazing. <laughs> Scatman made those sounds while he was falling downstairs. <laughs> <laughs> okay, oh, uh, I got That's what it sounded like. Ba -ba -da -ba, to -ba -da -ba. All right, well, listen, listen to him. <laughs> right. I told you, my friend John uh, once said it would be amazing if <laughs> Scatman made those sounds while he was falling downstairs. <laughs> 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 oh yeah, man. Oh yeah. Just wonderful. Fuck. 
Just the best. This is so stupid. Uh, <laughs> but you can picture it so clearly, can't you? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> like at the exact same pace, too. Like his fucking limbs are all floppy. Scott, my never do that. I literally just choking oh on my, my food God. while I listen to this shit. It's the funniest fucking image I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> it's really good. And after he's collapsed in a heap of broken bones at the bottom of the stairs, he's just like, skibby dibby dibby on da da Like one hand comes up. It's like, it just completely hits the, the very bottom right at the edge. Nidum, nidum, nidum. I'm the scared man. Oh, God. That's so fucking funny. There's some about there's some about stare jokes that really get me. Yeah, I know. There's there's a, my favorite old girl Chan joke is when uh, Yusuke falls down the stairs. <laughs> this is the first thing I animated in Girl Chan three. Was Yusuke falling down the stairs? <laughs> it's, it's just she's like, let's go, and then it just cuts to like. Poof, 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 poof. <laughs> <laughs> That is pretty freaking wonderful. Uh, and I remember I, I did the foley for that. I had like a bunch of boxes in my uh, in my room, and I just like <laughs> stuck a microphone in front of them and just started fucking throwing them around. Foley is the best. No, <laughs> oh, I think I'm fucked here. I don't no, think maybe I can... you just need him to like plow through somehow. Oh, oh, there it is. Oh my goodness. Yeah, yeah you, you oh, now still need the frog him, suit to complete yeah, that. Yeah, move him out of the way. This is cool. Yeah. Ross, you clever bastard. <laughs> I can't believe he, were, he did these. I didn't want to call him a bitch, so I tried to change course. Yeah, that's this. really, really cool. Um, I, uh... It, I can't believe he did these... It's so okay, so... <laughs> <laughs> and then they, they proceed to go into a bit uh, where, they're, where they talk about, um... They talk about how they talk about doing the scat the scat dance in like super slow motion. So they're like they're like skit that and that and it's funny. Oh god, no, I love Game Grumps. I've been I, I watch literally anytime I see them pop up in my feed, I watch them. Oh. Oh. But yeah, no, that's the, the funniest thing ever. I love it. <laughs> oh. My abs hurt. Swaggy, you're absolutely correct. Oh, should I? Should I upload it to the tweet? Should I tweet it? Did I not? I did. I did do a JPEG. Tweet. Oh Christ! <laughs> but yeah, no. There's so many. There's so many good bits in um in Game Grumps that that I just I can't name them all. I can't name my favorite one because there's just so many good ones. Do they have? Is, did I click out of that? Let's see. Let's. <laughs> Hopefully it's not ridiculously loud. Newgrounds.com Grand sponsor Boy, I sure am glad we stopped for hot dogs. Yes. And these flavor sticks really add to the taste. <laughs> <laughs> hey, pass the flapjacks, go to Baru San Sama. Don't forget the syrup. How could I? Forget I mean. <laughs> Puny, you karyotic being. Galactic Amaru is a prokaryotic being. That explains everything. Oh, we're kind of eating here. <laughs> That's okay. I'll that make this quick. That explains everything. Don't forget about the Bushido Blasters. Oh, yeah! I forgot. See, I knew <laughs> you would. Yeah, he's like that. Yeah, he is. <laughs> 
Well, all right. I guess you guys can go back to eating your hamburgers. Yeah, they are hot dogs! <laughs> <laughs> that is the first time you've de ever defeated anybody, Yusuke. <laughs> wow, yeah. Wowie, wowie, zowie! My wrist communicator is getting a transmission! Hey, all right. G fighters, two twins with their mouth believe they've been kidnapped by machine automatic number 12! Wow, that sounds exciting! Why did he work to work a wrist communicator? I guess we should go. Who's going to cover this bill? It's on the house, guys! What the fuck? <laughs> That's not the real store owner. Huh. He would never give <laughs> us a free meal. Oh, thank you. I will repay you by giving you a free meal. <laughs> what were we doing? Oh, yeah, the twins of Thermopylae. There they are. All the way on the 78th floor. No match for me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there they are! But where is the Captain Buster? <laughs> <laughs> it's just ten minutes of pure stupidity. No, I wanted I wanted to bring up Girl Chan 3, that way you guys could hear the box joke. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> oh god, okay. Flats. This is an art stream. <laughs> It's an art stream, guys. Just in case you didn't know. But I can't I can't necessarily uh stream everybody else's videos on here. I'm sure that people wouldn't appreciate that. The Power Hour ones make me laugh the hardest because you actually see them do these shenanigans. I have yet to watch Power Hour. I need to actually sit down and watch Power Hour. I just watch the Game Grumps ones because they're the, like I either watch the Game Grumps animated or I watch just like Game Grumps, like where they're playing the game. I can't remember what game they were playing, but Aaron was like getting stupid mad, uh, stupid mad at it. And Dan was just losing his mind the entire time because Aaron just kept getting mad. They're good. Hysterical. Oh, yeah, dude. They're so funny. But, yeah, the, 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 the two Sonic the Hedgehog bits were the Sonic Unleashed and the Sonic Boom bits were, like, top tier. Top tier game grumps. Like, as much as I like JonTron, like, I look back at, like, stuff that they used to do when they were, like, when those those were the Game Grumps. And they're just, it's it's not the same. But. <laughs> oh, okay. All right, thanks so much, Wolf. You, uh, get some rest, man. And, uh, I will talk to you later yeah you have a good night wolf you know Aaron raised a black knight in battle kid 3 I think battle kid I think battle kid 3 was the one it was that the one was that the one that had like the flower that like changed colors because I'm pretty sure there was one like that and he was like raging super hard at it yeah that was that's the one I was losing my damn mind on that one. This is the number one. No. Best Don't want to watch more YouTube videos. <laughs> but. <laughs> okay, guys. I think I'm going to hop off for the night. It's almost 11 o'clock over here. So I'm going to hop off. <clears throat> um, I will be back next week on Tuesday. And hopefully uh, we'll be able to finish this one up. Love, Zach.
yeah, we'll um we'll try to finish this one up. Uh depends on what my homework says. Oh <laughs> whoopals. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'll be back. Um I'll be back uh next Tuesday. And we're probably gonna finish up uh doing like the shading and stuff for this piece if my homework uh says it's okay. Um if that's what my homework is anyway. Cause I got a bunch of homework, so I can't necessarily just work on the piece at my leisure because I gotta gotta go along with it. But yeah, um I'll be I'll be back next Tuesday. Um if you guys um haven't subscribed yet, please. I love you. <laughs> and um you know, subscribe if you guys want to hit me up on Twitter. Uh feel free. I have my phone on me all all the time. And until then, I will talk to you guys later. But all right, you guys have a great night. Get some rest, get some food, and see ya. <laughs>